Hey guys, remember a couple minutes ago when we talked about primary groups? Well, let's talk about them again. When you create a new user, for instance, we use user add Jake, and then we do groups Jake, you'll see there is a Jake group created along with the Jake user. On Linux systems, when you create a file, that file gets assigned the primary group of the user who created that file as its default group. So if we wanted to change the default group of a file for a user, we would have to change the primary group of that user. So how do we change the primary group of that user? Well, that's simple. We use the new group command. So we're logged in as root right now. And if we were to run it ls-lh, we'd see that we have a grep.txt already. And that file was created by root. And root's default or primary group is root. To change the primary group, we use the new group command. First, we list our groups. To do that, we do groups, and then we see root and sales. From groups, we then <coughs> add a new group. So we do new group, and we'll add accounting, and then we'll list our groups again. And you see now we have three groups listed there. Now what happens when we make a file? Let's try it out. Let's do touch file to and then we want to do ls-l to view all the information you see we now have a file to the primary user is group but now the primary group is accounting and that's because we changed the primary group on the root account so remember boys use new group to change your primary group and that changes the default group of files you make for that user